Okay guys, as requested, this is a proper version of stage one and two of the course. I'll do one stage at a time. So this is my design. You can see stage two over there. So this is the tame stage. First obstacle here is the cargo net to Leap of Faith, which is, it looks like a really fun obstacle to me. You climb up the net, get onto the top of the platform, and you have a three meter leap, three and a half meter leap from the top into a foam pit. So if anyone's brave enough to do that, that sounds really good. This is swinging the gap where the rope will be attached here on a stand and you just swing across the gap trying to avoid landing in the foam there and landing on this big blue mat at the end. Then the rope cling, you have to hold on to the ropes standing on these little discs at the bottom of each rope. There are seven of them and each of them are about a meter apart so you need to step from one to the other get to the end. This is just traditional monkey bars. There are going to be 10 monkey bars in total, so you need to be pretty good to do 10 monkey bars, but that's the hope that some people are going to be pretty solid. Then this is the tame pipe scrambler, so it's the easy version of the full version, and you have to run up to the top and pull yourself up, and as you can see there's a rope on there to help out anyone who's struggling. Then this is probably my favorite one. It's called target practice. It's what I used to do as a kid. As you can see, there's a swing there, which is connected to the top of the frame. You get onto the swing and you swing down and leap off, trying to avoid this foam and landing on this big blue mat. Then another one that I can't wait to try, which is the step control. So you run up to the steps, you go right leg, left leg, right leg, left leg, right leg, and get to the end very smoothly, hopefully. Then step up, which is a trampette up to a mat. So you run up to the trumpet, you jump on the mat, jump on the trumpet, and then try and land on top of the mat. If you miss, you just fall. Then the balance bridge, which rotates on a horizontal axis, like a, a car axle. So you need to sprint across this as fast as possible. Going slowly will not work, you'll just fall off. So you need to really just go as fast as you can, and hopefully not slide off to either side. Then you have the final obstacle, it's not vertical though it probably will feel that way by the time you get to the end and you run down and then run up to the top and then you're done and congratulations anyone who makes it to that stage you win a medal and you win access to the insane course as you can see there in the background another video of that will be coming soon thank you very much for watching